work. Alright, so button 1 plus button 2. Right now they're both equal 0, so obviously the, uh, the so, sorry, so obviously the uh, lift is going to be 0. Now if button 1 is pressed, it equals 1. Uh, 0 plus 1 equals 1. So it moves to 100 length. So now if you make button 2 equal 1, we've got 1 plus 1 equals 2. Which obviously is not 1, so it's going to it's gonna go back down to 0 then, because it's not equal to 1. Do you get what I'm going at here? Do you, you, see what, you see what this means? What this is doing now? Hopefully you do. <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, really easy. It's a lot cleaner. I mean, look at that. My wiring's not completely straight, but it doesn't even take, well, it takes up half the board, that's it. Otherwise, you'd have different gates down scattered at the bottom. You'd have much more wiring. It just doesn't look as nice as this. Plus, this teaches you how to use this statements, and this statements are extremely cool. So, that's it. Really easy contraption made with an expression gate. You can use if statement in so many different um, situations. You can make it in that range I was talking about. You know, if range or length is less than 50, um, turret equals 1, so it can kill anyone that walks in front of the ranger. Um, it could be used in doors, it can be used in lots of things. You just, you just need to think of somewhere where it could be used and apply it to it. It's not, it's not hard, you see how easy it can be. Uh, you can check us out on gmodtech.net. That's our forums. If you've got any help, uh, if you've got any questions, we can help you there. Or you can join our two build servers. One runs on gm underscore flat grass, and one is gm botmap version two. Um, feel free to leave a comment. Though we do suggest you sign up on our forums because you'll probably get a faster reply there. I uh, hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Hope you've learned something, and I hope you'll use it somewhere, somewhere good. Uh, thanks for watching.